So Paul and I are in Otford. We just dropped her, his car off uh, in Cuxton. Cuxton, near the Medway. Uh, so it's been quite a bit of a drive this morning. Uh, and now we're in Otford where we finished off last Sunday and heading on the North Downs Way. Let's go. There's the ancient pond in Otford. We're just making sure we know where we're going. <laughs> As we're going up the hill, one of the original North Downs Way signs. It's Lady Kelsing on the Pilgrim's Way Road. And there we are, North Downs Way signs. And we're North going... Downs Way you have to walk like this. <laughs> That's according to the sign. <laughs> there you go, with your arm stretch. Okay, we're a bit confused, we have to follow the road a bit. As we said before, it's very well way signed, the North Downs Way. But occasionally you've got to keep your eye on the ball. So we're just looking at the map as we go along, and hopefully it's a little turning off one of these roads. If not, we'll have to head back. Okay, we found it, that's the old sun cars. We're going this way now. Oh, yes, I saw this on um, a website, this little route. It's only a tiny little bit of road walking, which is great. So we come out of this rather nice house across this orchard. Oh, orchard. This is a word we don't use enough of. Orchard. Orchard. So we can... Fruity. Fruity. You can tell we're in Kent now because the North Downs is one of those signs, as I said, has got a different font. So I think we're going to the next page. That way. I love these old little gates and walls. So we come out on this rather lovely view across Kent. Which is rather lovely. As we uh, move downs, it's all about the chalk. Chalk downs. It's all very nice, very sunny. If you remember back to the uh, third video, I think it was, when I got drenched, got down a bit of waterproofs, Paul very kindly thought ahead and actually bought me waterproofs. So that was very nice on the bicep this week. I don't like weighing myself down with stuff from walking. It's just... I, can see a train from I can see a train from here, yeah. That's a lovely view. We're walking to a field. Oh, look at beautiful steed. Oh, aren't they lovely? Hello. Oh, they're gorgeous. And there's a cross in the fields, and the guy books don't quite know what it's doing there, but there you go. And as we walk through the fields, this is an old wall, I think it was part of the old manor, probably the old kitchen wall. Which is lovely because the view is rather spectacular, as you can see. So we've got to get our skates onto Rotham, Rotham, where we're going to have lunch because the pub we want to go to stops serving food at 2 30. It's ten past quarter past twelve now, so it's a nice old building there. But actually, I don't, so Paul's saying it looks very oldly wood. I don't think actually as old as probably seems, but unusual design. And there's one of the lovely North Downway markers. Farnham 60 miles that way and Canterbury 54 miles that way and Dover 65 miles that way. We are doing the Canterbury loop so that's lovely. Very cool. Come from there onto a little bit of road walking, just crossing the road more or less. As we head downwards, yes, there it is. Yeah, North Downs Way to Rotham is only two and a quarter miles, so we should right. be on good time. Should be on good time for dinner. But well, you got to road. have, yeah, you got to have the right tool for the right job. And there's some right tools around. There, there are some right tools around. There's two right here. <laughs> hey, <laughs> right, yeah, it's right. We're, we're going down over this field, lovely field. Hey! Oh, very cool. Uh, going down this field and heading towards Rotham, or Rotham. Once again, sorry if we pronounced it wrong, put it in the comments section. Okay, so, it's all signed and we're going off-road now. Down this way. So we're on a boat. No. Right boat? away, open to all traffic. Oh, right. Okay, so we are. could get run over by 4 by 4s So we've got to be vexed careful. Okay, coming out into this road, and we'll just go across. Rotham one and a quarter miles, and we're going down there. The 
going through over there. I hope it's not too blowy. Like, because it's only kind of domestic can cord I'm using for this. I don't know how the sound will sound until I'm cutting it later on. So apologies if you just hear wind. Yeah. <laughs> hey! And I hope you heard that joke. If not, I think you can work it out. That's if you heard me say wind in the first place. Let me get my chef. Alright, some nice houses. Oh, that's a lovely house. We go down that way, but if we go this way, we don't avoid a part of the North Downs Way. On the lovely old properties, there's the church. It's time for lunch. Here we are. Awesome. Very much enjoying our lunch. Paul's got. <coughs> what have you got, Paul? Moose morning. It looks really nice. I have an omelette and salad. It's lovely as well. So we've had lunch at the Rose and Crown, which is really nice. And now we've got to walk back up. Of course, it's taking a thick photo and we're going to rejoin the North Downs Way just past the church. Okay, just finding the bridge to cross over. Rotham Water. Okay, so it's just going on down this hill following the road. It is, down, then up. Remember kids, the countryside code. When you're walking, doing road walking, make sure you have the traffic, you're facing the traffic as it's oncoming. Walk on the right side of the road, not the wrong side. Yeah. Mm. There's some hop houses over there. I mean, how many roads can be called Pilgrim's Way, really, in Kent? And sorry for that reason, there's so many. Uh, but we're carrying on down the NDW. Indeed, NDW. Let's get uh, phonetic and uh, phone nice over there. And we're going down here. This is quite a long route again. We're pretty much working level, but we have this glorious scenery to our right, which is lovely. As Paul and I walk up this steep encampment, we uh, wonder how this old microwave that seems to have been here for ages got here. Why would someone dump a microwave halfway up part of the North Downs Way? <sighs> Ridiculous, isn't it, Paul? Hey? It's a microwave. That's a microwave. See that everyone? He's, he's clever, he's clearly a performer. I'm a real actor of course. Um, microwave. Well, I'm here all week, thank you very much ladies and gentlemen. Oh, just be aware this is a bit of a dangerous road actually, the one we're walking on. We've had a couple of heavy duty vehicles come bombing down. Always be careful guys. Uh, Kent's got some great standing stones, people who know me. I'm very much into stone circles and ancient monuments. Uh, the Golden Stones are near here, uh, by the National Trust. And the Chestnuts, I have to admit, I've never heard of them, which is interesting. But people have seen my videos uh, for Avebury, I've been going to for 25 years, know what an obsessive nut I am about that place. Very powerful energy centre. It's a nice uh, cathedral of trees walking through in the country park, and we walk down the way. It's very nice. We're thinking it's going to rain. The atmosphere is changing. You always sense it's going to rain. I think it's going to. So. I don't see it so much on the camera because it's uh, got good low light. But it's really dark because the cloud covers come over, so it's uh, a little bit creepy. It's really got trees like that. A bit excited now. We're going to uh, Cauldron Lung Barrow place I've wanted to see all my life and I've never been here before so as predicted just peeing it down but I think it's only a heavy shower as I said on the weather so I hope it will pass very soon there it is Cauldron Lung Barrow and it's absolutely chucking it down I really want you to see this properly it's like a mini Glastonbury you've got all the offerings on the tree all our pagan friends. It's a lot of Avery and Swallowhead Spring. I start raining, a little bit of a rainbow coming up. I don't know if you can quite see it. Probably not, it's a bit too faint at the moment. Above the streets and houses, ring goes flying high. Well, there it is, yeah. It's uh, six and a half miles to Cuxton, where we parked Paul's car. So we're trundling on. Just looking down, and we found. 
a pillbox. I don't think it is a pillbox actually. See, it's another nice rainbow in the distance. Soaring on towards Cuxton at the end of the day's walk. Getting a bit broken now. We just quickly stopped to admire the view, not the industrial view, <laughs> but the, the view. We're sort of heading that way over the hills and into Cuxton. It's been good. So peaceful. Okay, as we walk up, we've come to this. Oh joy. It's got to be done. Over when we get home. Here we go. Hello. Hello. Nothing for you, mate. No, sorry. No. Sorry. Just passing Holly Hill House. It's an old flint building. Isn't it? Lovely. That's rather wonderful. Okay. We're now walking through an estate, apparently. So the nudge said back there, but this is the way the North Downs Way goes. Not far from Cuxton. Paul and I. Are a little bit broken now. It's been 15, actually about 15.5 miles though, as you can see in front. We took a detour about half a mile to Cauldron Lung Barrow. But it's been a great day, really nice day. Oh, great company over there. Yeah. Um, yeah, a little bit more and we'll be at the end. It's a nice one. We'll come out of the forest, just heading down here then up again. It's a nice little park. Oh. Map, I'm not sure. Nearly nearing the end, probably about a mile to go. So come out by with lovely cottages. Nearly, nearly in Cuxton. Of course, just checking the map. That's what been rather nice. As we is in Upper Bush. Oh, the larks you'd have with that for name. Seeing some detectorists in the field. Look. If I point the camera, they might freak out thinking we we're from uh, English heritage. Yeah, okay. We've got the right to do this field, you know. Yes. Right, which way are we going now? It's We're going across the field. Across that way. Oh, nearly there. Ten to seven. It's a long, hard walk. But fun. Just going over the railway bridge. There's quite a few. I shall do this under your eyes there. Yeah. There it is. We've got 0.8 miles left. As the sun dims, casting a long shadow, we walk over this lovely field up towards Cuxton. We think, what a great day it's been. As we stroll back to the car, just around the corner, there's a the River Medway. And after 17 miles today, including its diversions, that's our lot done. Um, until next time, thanks for joining us. <laughs>